to ask about your name coming up in the news recently regarding this comedian. No, no, we don't answer that. Welcome back to The Insider. We got more Cosby news. Yeah, well, Bill Cosby remains mom, speaking only through his attorney. His nephew Braxton is speaking out in defense of his uncle. And even more women are coming forward with sexual assault accusations. The question is, are these women strategically orchestrating these stories? Tonight, we have to ask, is there a Cosby conspiracy? If he wants to be found innocent in the court of public opinion, there's a very easy way for him to do that. He can do the interview of his choice with any station in the country. Hiding behind lawyers with all of these allegations will not help Bill Cosby. Now Bill's nephew and CEO of his production company, Braxton Cosby, is doing the talking. In an interview with FarrahGray.com, Braxton says, quote, my uncle and his legacy are still more alive than ever before, despite the unjustified claims. Our media insider, Ron Tarosian. When I heard that Bill Cosby's nephew came out and spoke about his innocence, I said to myself, wow, they found the guy who believes in him. That's the one. Cosby does have his supporters. Some, like Vivica A. Fox, feel that he's been unjustly tried in the media. It just seems like people are kind of jumping on the bandwagon. I think right now that it's like a public... Uh, witch hunt. But those willing to speak out on his behalf are few and far between. I feel that as a comedian, I'm devastated. I grew up loving his work. And, you know, what disturbs me the most is that people don't want to believe these women who are coming forward who have no agenda. I think that Bill Cosby might be not guilty in the court of law. But in the court of public opinion, he's been tried and he's been found guilty. Still, Braxton Cosby is holding on to the notion that the media is conspiring to take down his uncle, saying, quote, we need content and messaging that is positive, uplifting, and inspirational. I feel that the goal here was to destroy the attempts to instill that type of entertainment going into the next year. Thankfully, it will not succeed. This concept of a media lynch when it's a lot of women who don't know each other, who are coming out throughout the years and saying very similar stories, I think the public opinion in America believes that Bill Cosby has done something bad. Bill's lawyer denies all the recent rape accusations. On Thanksgiving 2014, we can say that the Bill Cosby family brand is over and finished with. So you mean to tell me that Bill Cosby's nephew feels this whole thing is a conspiracy to prevent Cosby from producing more positive programming? That would mean that 19 women accusing Cosby of sexual improprieties called each other up, got their stories straight, and then conspired to bring Cosby down. Seems I'm sorry. In my opinion, I don't buy this. Michael, right. I, I want to bring you in on this. Yeah, uh, first of all, one thing that makes me upset is when they blame the women for not speaking out right away right. if they were raped. And that makes yeah. me so upset because at nine years old, something terrible happened to me. And I was embarrassed. I was scared. And I, I, luckily, it only happened once, but I just turned 40 years old. And I just told my parents about it last year. Yeah. It took me 30 years to tell my parents. So when I hear something like this, it makes me angry. It makes me upset. I love you. All right, let's move on to something.